Ladies and gentlemen, Six Fig Stock Trader here from YouTube, and today we're going to be talking about Internet Computers ICP. Let's get into this. Welcome back to the channel, everyone. If you guys could please subscribe, smash that like button, I would truly appreciate it. What in the world is going on with ICP, folks? We had a very nice squeeze to the upside Earlier this week, we saw prices hit about $9.78. What? That was crazy. So we are now filling out this very, very nice symmetrical triangle. And I do think that we might have a chance at seeing prices over the next couple of weeks return to these $9 plus levels for ICP. As long as this doesn't turn out to be some sort of bear flag, I think that there is that chance. However, the symmetrical triangle in a lot of cases indicates that the continuation of the previous trend might happen. So my worst fear is that on the daily chart, we see the 50 moving average kind of clobber down like that. And my worst fear is that we see ICP return to these $9.32 levels and a sell-off happens. So I'm hoping that we do not see that. But for now, this could be one of these things too where we see some sort of ascending triangle build and then blast us up to this uh, 200 moving average. So right now on the daily Price, I think, will continue to squeeze in between the $7.50 level and $9.30-ish cent level, probably going into uh, June 15th, 16th, 20th, somewhere in that neighborhood. Let's see if we can pull up any Fibonacci time sequence. And really, we're going to measure from April 4th down to May 12th. And June 19th is a date that we're going to really need to pay attention to for ICP. So after you guys get done with this video, open up your phones, head over to the calendar, mark June 19th, internet computer price, and then put in there, increase volatility or chance of a reversal. So we might see some sort of reversal happen. We might see some increased volatility uh, that really propels ICP to the upside. So when we look at the current position of ICP, what do we get? Well, we kind of got this 50 moving average barreling downwards and the 200 moving average really following along quite nicely. However, we can see that this, uh, this conversion line through Ichimoku Cloud Trading, this little red line here, has started trading horizontal. And we can see the blue baseline is really barreling down towards the conversion line. So whenever we see that this conversion line trades sideways and then crosses up over the baseline, a lot of times we will get a very nice explosive price reaction out of that to the upside. So let's just look at this as an example. So once we start to see this price start arcing up, this red conversion line start going upwards, crosses the blue baseline, get a very nice explosion of price to the upside. Here's another example of it right here. So currently that is what we are looking for right now, or at least I am. Uh, also note that there is this very significant trend line that ICP is going to have to break through. And it appears somewhere that, that we might get a chance to do this. I'd say anywhere from the 12 to $15 ish range there is kind of a little thinner part of this ichimoku cloud here so i would like to see price action really kind of try to break through uh this part nonetheless really we're just gonna have to play the waiting game as the markets kind of continue to squeeze sideways and that's one of the reasons i really haven't been that active the last week and a half it's a great time when the market's trading sideways and it's down to really take a step back get your batteries recharged, things like that. So uh, we're back at it uh, and, and we will be keeping a close eye on ICP. I got some also uh, some big news coming up. I'm going to be releasing some data and some findings that FTX uh, is really operating some shady business schemes 
behind the backs of investors. And I've really narrowed it down to ICP launch and another launch of another token, uh, which I will get into when I release this video. It's crazy. I've done this deep dive. Uh, so another reason to subscribe to the channel. Also, check out the end screens. I've got some great little videos on what exactly happened at ICP's launch and some other great ICP ecosystem vids. So we'll see you guys all on the next video.